guys, today we get to talk about a very interesting surprise. I would never have expected this to happen, but it is happening. Eternal Masters is getting a reprint just in time for Christmas. So definitely a cool Christmas present. A amazing, it's amazing, Wizards of the Coast is doing its best to make Magic Hearts affordable. As someone who's played this game for a long time, I can't recall the last time they did something where they said it was limited and then they immediately, almost immediately, remember Eternal Masters was this summer. So we are six months removed and we already get a reprint. Now, how this will affect Aether Vault and how large their reprint will be, that's left to discussion, but wow. Wow, I mean, this is, leave me a comment below. This is unheard of for Wizards of the Coast and unheard of in Magic the Gathering to have a reprint of a set so close to its release. Does this mean that Modern Masters 2017 can have a December set? Does that mean these prices will drop even more? Yes, the prices will drop a lot of these cards because they can reprint it anytime they want. Anytime they can reprint it in March 2017, they can reprint it even right after they release Modern Masters 2017. I think it is amazing. I think having drafts of Eternal Masters during Christmas time, during Black Friday, really, really quite amazing and something that is surprising. Because they are listening to what the players want. And the players want you know, these legacy cards to be as cheap as possible. And the players want to draft. They just want to draft this amazing set. And this punishes. It will punish people who have purchased boxes of this. And they're, they were holding on to it. Expecting value. Because it sets a clear example. Where Wizards of the Coast can now. It's saying hey. We can now reprint a entire set of reprints so reprinting a reprint fascinating anyway leave me a comment below bye guys